Game of the Cookies is not responsible for any of your PC and or game files. I advise you to watch the full video before installing anything. Always mod at your own risk. I also advise you to back up your game files. Thank you and enjoy the video. What is going on you guys? Welcome back to another FR tutorial guys and today we are going to be installing cop holster guys Now a lot of you guys are gonna be watching this video and be like cookies. It, it crashes my game all the time Okay, I'm not gonna install it, it crashes my game guys. That is not the case. I figured out thanks to uh, SGT Harvey um, I, I hope I said his name right. Um, you guys know who he is. I just made a tutorial on his gun sounds, his combat pistol sounds, guys. But anyways, uh, he showed me how to make it so that it doesn't crash your game, guys. And I have tested it myself in game, and it does not crash your game at all, guys. So I'm gonna show you guys how to install it so that it does not crash your game. And this is uh 2021. Um, so uh, today, guys, I'm going to be obviously showing you guys how to install it, and let's get into it. Uh, so go ahead and click the link in the description, and it's going to bring you to this page right here, Cop Holster uh, 3.2.0.0. Uh, and once you guys are on this page, I'm sure what a lot of you guys know what Cop Holster does. Um, it puts it so that you can hit your right shift on your keyboard, and uh, he'll put his hand on the gun, and you can walk around with that. Uh, but anyways guys you're gonna click the blue download button here click agree and download all right well that's done i hope you guys are having a great day uh i told you guys i would be uploading more which as you guys can see i am starting to upload a little, a little bit more um definitely because this is the weekend but guys like i said before i'm going to be uploading more and more and more um as school ends but guys you're gonna go ahead and click on the winrar for the cop holster and open that baby up right there all right and you're not gonna drag the plugins folder in just yet there's actually one setting that we got to change uh, so it doesn't crash your game so guys when you are in your main directory here uh, what you guys are gonna do is you're gonna navigate to the lspdfr folder all right so go ahead and go in there and for the lspdfr.ini all you guys got to do is just double click it and it opens up just like this Again, guys, that is the LSPDFR INI. All right, and what you guys are gonna do is where it says hashtag defaults, you're gonna go three lines down. So one, two, and three. Right here, guys, you're gonna wanna change this to true. Uh, it's got the ambient dot disable player holster, uh, hosting actions. You wanna put this to true, T-R-U-E. There you go. And just click file, save. So guys, what you did right here is, you, I don't know if some of you guys know, but in the M menu, you guys can go to, uh, scroll down to, I think it's like actions, I think it is, and, uh, and change it to like intermediate or something like that. I don't exactly remember what the name is, but it does the same thing. But this right here, guys, cop holster, it's a key bind. So all you guys got to do is hit your right shift key, and that's all you guys got to do. But this is going to make it so it doesn't crash your game. So this is a very important step, guys. Changing this to true. Uh, this is a very important step so that your game does not crash. Like I said, guys, once you get done changing it to true, go ahead and click file, save, and close out of that. All right. And I like to hit the back arrow in your main directory so you come back to the main page. Go ahead and refresh. This is what I do. All right. And now, guys, all you have to do is take this plugins folder and drag it and drop it right in to your LSPDFR main directory. Go ahead and give it a little refresh. And that is it guys. That is how you install Cop Holster. Now guys, I will see you guys in a second in game to test it out. And I'll see you guys in a second. Alrighty guys, so as you guys can see, we are in game in LSPDFR. As you guys can see. All right, so what we're going to be doing is we are obviously going to be demonstrating the cop holster for you guys. So uh, how to get the cop holster, you're going to hit your right shift key on your keyboard. It's going to be right shift, and it's going to put his hand right there, guys. His hand is going to be right there. All right. And now if you guys want to pull out your gun, what you're going to have to do is you're going to have to set this up, okay? So whatever gun you guys like, your pistol, combat pistol, whatever one it is, I like my combat pistol. 
So what you guys are going to want to do, okay? Hold your pistol or your combat pistol in your hand, okay? And press tab once. And he'll put it away. Okay. Alright, there you go. Now hold your right shift down. You don't have to hold it, I'm sorry. Just tap your right shift for the cop holster. Alright, and then if you guys want to pull out your gun, you're going to tap uh, your tab button. Alright? And it's going to pull out like that. Just like that, guys. Alright? Again, press tab to put it back. Alright, you can walk up to the okay. vehicle. How's it going, sir? And then the guy comes out, if he does. If he does. Uh, if he does, he does. You know? Then he comes out. You can do so. You, you do. You can. You, you want. You want him to do you so much. You can do anything. And start shooting. You pull out your gun. And start shooting, guys. And that is it, guys. So the cop holster does work, as you guys can see. You just press down right shift. Let me just put my gun away. Press down right shift. And there you guys go. That's how you install cop holster, guys. And as you guys can see, it does work. But guys, I hope you do enjoy, and if you did, make sure to smash the like button, and like always, we'll catch you guys on next one. Peace out, guys. Peace!